Uh, Paddy, Gord said that the team's feeling good and, and confident going into this one. From what you've seen over the past two days, two days off, what's the vibe of, of the group going into this one? Yeah, it's great, mate. It's um, where we want to be. Um, you know, there, there's a lot of things that we've learnt from throughout the whole course of this campaign, from when we got together in, in Cairns till now. Um, a lot of things that we've learnt about each other in the locker room, on the court, um, back at the hotel. Um, every day for us is, is about getting better and, and it's about us. Um, you know, the adversity that gets thrown our way is, is how that we how we deal with it. Um, and I think it's a real character building um, opportunity for us that has put us in a um, you know, good position moving forward. But all in all, um, you know, the goal is clear. Um, how we go about executing that goal is clear. Um, and, you know, you live for, for games like this, um, World Cup, international stage. Um, this is where the, the passion comes pouring out for sure. Do you think at all about the, the win uh, over Slovenia in Tokyo and think about maybe them wanting to get vengeance over that and you guys make, making sure that you don't let them get that? No, nah, mate, that was uh, two years ago. That was um, done and dusted and it's two years moving on now. And um, uh, again, it's, it is all about us and, and how we can um, you know, continue to get better as a group. Um, and. You know, they're probably thinking the same thing as, as well. So um, I think that the focus, is, as always, is about um, is, is about us and, and how we can move forward. So um, you know, that past was in the past. Now this is a whole new, whole new deal. What gives you confidence that this team can come together and collectively guard Luca as a group? Yeah, our, our athleticism, our size, our length, um, our high motor. Um, you know, you look down the end of the bench and. Each person can, can get the job done. Um, and not saying that it's only going to take one person to get it done. This is definitely going to be a, a team job. Um, but like I said, our, our strength from the beginning has been our defence. Um, and we feel like we, we've still got our best basketball to play on that end, end of the floor. So being able to put things in, in the bank from our, our games that we've already played, um, coming into this one feeling confident about you know being our best defensive game that we've played this tournament, and, and, and it will need to be. George mentioned Luca controlling the tempo of games and how excellent he is at that. Uh, what can you guys do to make sure that you can speed up the game and, and make the most of the athleticism you guys have? Yeah, exactly. He's a, he's a mastermind and um, his ability to control the tempo and, and pace of, of a game is, is what he's good at. Um, so for us, it's just going to make it um, you know uncomfortable for him and, and you know get up and down the floor as, as quick as we can. So um, it, it's going to be you know. 40 minutes of, of every possession counts. Paddy, I was going to ask about Xavier Cooks and your thoughts on his <coughs> impact in this tournament and how much have you seen him grow from the start of camp to now? Yeah, he, he's been massive for us and, and we knew all along that he would be that um, utility within the group that can get things done. Um, you know, 2019 he went down with an injury that um, saw him miss the, the squad. Um, you know, in the World Cup then and, and you know, missed out again in, in Tokyo. So now to have him in the group, he, he's really come in with a lot of, um, you know, firepower within to be able to play with the passion that he plays with. And it's exactly what we've needed. And, you know, you watch him play and you watch how the other guys react to him as well. And, and he's kind of got that um, value about him that makes the other guys go as, as well. So a high engine guy and, and he's been brilliant. Um, and, and like I said, that utility and what he does is, is exactly what we've needed to, to be able to you know get this thing done. Patty, uh, Josh Green has improved uh, you know year after year in the last couple of years. What have you liked about his development and his impact for your team? Yeah, he's been he's been massive. His development um, at both ends of the floor has been huge. He's gone um, you know leaps and bounds from from Tokyo. Um, you've seen it in his play uh, in Dallas and now coming back here. Um, you know, another one of those guys that does all the little things right and, and another piece that obviously last game, um, you know, he, he done really well. So being able to crawl into you defensively and, and speed you up and then down the other end, being able to knock down open shots, you know, cut, slash, um, you know, constant movement with, without the ball. Um, another guy that, you know, both guys that you, you've mentioned, you know, extremely proud of their development and, and continued development, always wanting to learn, always wanting to get better. Um, and, and that's what our program here especially has, has set up. Thanks guys, appreciate it.